Hi guys, so today I will be making a small little Minecraft video and uh, well I plan I'm planning on creating a brand new series on this channel called Redstone Ready where I will be well simply making some redstone videos and tutorials and also ex simply exploring redstone. Uh, there were there might not be many discoveries while making this. Uh, but hey, at least we'll try to have some fun, try to learn some redstone, learn some tips and tricks, and uh, yeah, also make some tutorials. Uh, right here behind me, you can see that I have created something, but first, let's get our redstone suit on. It's pretty nice. Now, if I press this button, here we go. I have unlocked this chest where you can store all your valuable items like I don't know if you like if you like melons there we go you can use this as a hidden thing uh, or you can just use this as an entrance to your base now I will show you how redstone for this thing works over on this model model As you can see, it is pretty simple and pretty compact. Here, when you press the button, it sends the signal over into this T flip flop, which basically takes the signal from over here, turns it into a small one tick pulse. From here, it uh, turns it into a one tick pulse and sends it off to this block, this sticky piston, which then puts the block outwards and then doesn't pull it back because it is only a one tick pulse. This in turn activates this entire system which activates this, bit, this piston and goes upwards to these three pistons and this one piston up here. It also splits from that, pl from that one and goes up these glass blocks which are in the new snapshot for one for the version of Minecraft 1.14 and it is a pretty simple design as you can see there is also a double pix piston extender which goes which is activated by this redstone line that goes from here down and into the double piston extender that simply looks like this and I will show you how to make it right away we just need a button you put two pistons down you put a repeater here set to two ticks. You put an observer block, a button, it has to be a stone button though, and there we go. It works absolutely perfectly. We, that is also the reason why we need this stone button here. It is a pretty nice design. Over here, I have I've had my one of my friends come along and try to build a three by three piston. Though, as you can see, it did not go so well. But it is a very simple design for a three by three redstone door. It does not take much resources to build, and it is pretty and it is a pretty easy build overall. By the way, if you are playing in an older version of Minecraft than 1.14, Glowstone should work just fine for you. There we go. Glowstone works perfectly and can replace glass if you're re if you're playing in an older version. So, there you go guys, I hope you have enjoyed this first episode of, of my series called Redstone Ready, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.